We are so so excited to be here. The drive from Milan was supposed to be three and a half hours, but there was a couple like car accidents and stuff. It took us seven hours to get here. <laughs> and it was a little rough, but we are already in love with our hotel. We haven't even been to our room yet. We're just in the lobby. And I am so 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 excited to share this week with you. I feel like I'm going to pass out right now. I feel like I was just transported to another dimension. We are staying, I'm probably gonna say this wrong, but we're staying in the family hotel Kinder Sonwise in the Dolomites. And I knew this place would be amazing. I like read tons of reviews before we came, looked on their website. It's, it's basically like a five-star luxury hotel designed for kids. So there's like a farm with animals and you can go on tractor rides and there's water slides and heated pools and diving movies and Playgrounds, it's like a kid's dream. So I was really excited. But we reached out to the hotel to work with them to like do some photo video, share about them online. And we didn't know what room we were gonna get. We were like, honestly, anything is great. We're, we're just so excited to be here. I, I, I feel like I'm, I honestly feel like I'm gonna cry right now. This is, sorry, okay. I'm so grateful. I'm so, 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 so grateful to be here. And I'm so grateful for my job. And I'm so grateful for all of you who watched so we could do things like this. I'm just so grateful. And I don't even know how this is real, but I'm gonna give you a, a house tour. And I'm so excited, I'm so excited. Okay, you, when you walk in the door, this is what you see. This beautiful, beautiful home it's huge so we start in here this is Knox's room and he has his own little sink his own shower and bath and then there's this queen bed but also this bunk bed situation so he's gonna be in there to put up this rail so he won't fall out so thoughtful and then you come in here there's a beautiful view I have no words I have no words for this but this is the kitchen table inside this is the sectional the TV and then that beautiful wood fireplace. I don't know what else to say besides it's beautiful. It's honestly, there's no words. It's the outdoor dining area. And then this is where things get really good. So this is our room. It's huge and it's amazing. There's Enzo's little crib. There's our own bath. It's really spacious too, but closet. Everything is so detailed too. Like this is a changing table. They thought of everything you would ever need with a baby or kids here. And then this is the shower, bathroom. But just wait, just wait, just wait. You walk outside. We have our own sauna, our own hot tub. And then the best part, our own pool. pool. Our own pool. heated pool. pool. Okay, let's go. Everybody. Pool. Not to switch. Woo! Yeah. You did it, honey. Hey, I did it. I did it. Good job, sweetie. Did you like the pool? Yeah. We have our own pool. Okay, hold your breath and kick it. Oh, and this is the view. I can't believe this is real. Everyone loves the animals. And yeah, we have a view of the farm right there. See. <laughs> <laughs> Ready? Let's see it. Woo! Can you do your booty one? Enzo, you do it. Nice! Okay, what the How are you feeling right now, babe? It's the best week of my life. This is the best thing that's ever happened to me. <laughs> okay, so Monday through Friday, they have a time where you can ride the little horses. There are so many cute little I'm the ride one. Are you excited? I'm the ride one. I know we have to wait in line. I'm ride that one. Okay. I'm ride that one. Hi, horsey. Hi. Oh. Oh. oh my gosh. He's so nice. He's got a lot of hair. 
<laughs> and so his hair looks like yours when you wake up. <laughs> What's the horse's name? Connie. Connie? Oh. You want to ride it? You want to ride it? Thanks. <laughs> Look at you! Hello. <laughs> so Knox, we don't touch the horse's mouth, but we can touch their. Woohoo! Yeah, Dinah can blow on their bathroom. Thank you. I ride on that one. Yeah. Tony. Barte, barte, Elliot, barte. Where's the horse? I ride a horse. Can I remember? Oh, you did. I love it. Oh, cow! Cow! You wanna go on and slide? <laughs> you wanna go slide, cow? Maybe he wants to. Aww. Maybe he wants to go his mama. Oh, maybe he wants his mama. The like seven kids areas. This is the baby room. So they have this little baby at her room. And then all oh. these toys. They have a kitchen, a little baby station. Knox is in heaven over here because he's been missing his cars so much. Okay, here's another play area. They have like bean bags, bikes, coloring stations, and then this is another player. Here's the water park, and then they have like air hockey, all these Legos, more playgrounds. It's kid heaven. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> This is the most beautiful thing in the world. I am freaking out, you guys. The up there. This is insane. It feels like a green screen. Okay, I know I'm saying this wrong, yeah. but we are at Paso de Urbe. Mm -hmm. And it's not that cold, but it's definitely more cold than we thought it when would the be. Sun comes out, it's not and so, yeah, and so, like. Probably 50. Yeah, it's definitely not warm, but we were talking to the nice man who was getting our like, money for parking. We're like, how long is this trail? And he's like, if you do the completed tour, four hours. But with you, I'm guessing you'll be back in five minutes. So, we'll see if we can make it longer than five minutes. I got an idea, here. Hi. 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 <laughs> we haven't even started this like hike yet. Let me try this. But it is. So, can take the so, 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 so stunning. Put your leg right now, I can't imagine the view getting any cooler than this, but this is the very, very beginning of the trail. So even if you're not like a big hiker, um, yeah. we're not really big hikers, but this is pretty paved. So you just park right there. It's $5 for the whole day. And then it's called, like I said, Paso del Urbe. And then you go right here. And this is already your view. So if you're not big into hiking or you don't have lots of time, it's totally worth coming out here still. Plus, the drive up was insane. Insanely beautiful. Like, I, maybe it's because we're here in May and there's not as many people here, but there was no other cars. We haven't seen anyone on the trail so far, and it's like these insane views. <laughs> there's this baby picnic table right here, which sounds cute, but that's like a cliff right there. I just don't understand the logic. Like, <laughs> you want to sit right there? Yeah. Yep, that's, that's the problem. <laughs> you guys, should we bring a picnic here tomorrow? Actually? Be fun. This is. <sighs> This is 15 minutes away from where we're staying. This! This! We are 10 minutes into the hike now. And it's just getting prettier. We've actually been blessed with the best weather since we've been here. It's a little cold today, maybe like 60, but it's been really sunny and super pretty. It was supposed to rain a lot, so we're really happy about that. Guys, are so sweet. Here. I love you. <laughs> are you happy, Knox? Oh. Are you happy here? <laughs> okay, picture time. If the Dolomites isn't on your bucket list yet, 
it needs to be. We've only been here for a few days and there's still so many things we haven't seen yet. We have a lot on our itinerary for the next week, but so far we love it. I honest, I didn't know what the Dolomites was until a few years ago. And basically it's in the most like Northern part of Italy. Apparently it used to be part of Austria. And then during World War II or World War I, um, Italy took it over. So there's still tons of like German, Austrian influences. A lot of the food is like Alpine food. Most people speak German, uh, but it's technically part of Italy. The nicest old Italian men just stopped us. I don't understand anything. Cole speaks oh, Spanish, so we can understand a little bit of what they're saying. Ow! But they just said, wait, what did they say, Cole? They were just saying, que, que bello los bambinos. Like, how, how cute your little kids are. And then, then they say the future. And then to the future or something like that. Okay, yeah. that? But me and Ali are just over here now. He's like, <laughs> Louis Vuitton. <laughs> Louis Vuitton, ciao, ciao. Billy, <laughs> ciao. We asked Knox. Knox told me the other day that he can speak Italian. Knox, can you speak Italian? He knows Bella Ciao. He said, Luigi Bella Ciao. <laughs> <laughs> not confident in swimming at all before this week and he just swam from there all the way to there two times mm -hmm. I'm so proud of him just one two three Every night they have a new menu, and this has been my favorite so far. It's steak with balsamic. It's okay. It's kid heaven. We just rented some e-bikes. The hotel had e-bikes and kids. And the kids are so excited. We have e-bikes at home, and we haven't gone in like a month. Since we've been traveling. Are you ready? Hi, Enzo. Go, Enzo. Yay. Yay. Clap, clap, clap. Yay. Yay. Yeah. Wow, that's fun. Hey, babe. Hey. How are you feeling? I'm gonna die. We just biked all the way from down there, further, to up here. And it's beautiful. And we're on e-bikes technically, but this is the most peaceful place. There's tons of these little tiny wood houses. It's just cute church. This town is so cute. We just drove to St. Magdalena Church. It's about 45 minutes away from our hotel and it's in the Val de... Oh, guys, I can't say anything. Val de Funes area. It's so pretty here. There's tons of meadows, really good views of the mountains and in this little cute church. Hi! Oh my gosh. This is awesome. I'm gonna kiss you. Look at, look at. 
soft, love. Be soft. I'm being nice. Aww. Be soft, Enzo. Soft. 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 <laughs> <laughs> Okay, everyone around us is wearing hiking gear and like full on parkas. And Knox doesn't even want to wear a jacket. He's in his sandals, his swimsuit, and his shirt. You want your jacket? No. Okay. Hey, everybody. You guys. Oh, you look sexy. We, ju <laughs> we just got to the iconic lake, Lago de Bresis. I don't know. Like I'm a little bummed though because it started pouring rain, like thunderstorm, full on situation. But it just cleared up a little bit. Um, I wore my swimsuit <laughs> and I have the kids in their yeah. swimsuit, but it's really cold. Probably so I'm stuck years. wearing this jacket. Yeah. Allie, can you show them this jacket, please? So she brought this jacket for me to wear all trip. And then she ran over on the e-bike yesterday. First off, ketchup stain, bad one. Look, there, look at their sleeves. Look at the sleeves. Sleeve. <laughs> look at the back. Look at the back. Okay, wait, lift your arm, lift your arm. You see that? You see that? And then rip, right there. Yes, she ruined my jacket. Go, well, it's hers, mine. mine. <laughs> Even in the rain, this place is absolutely beautiful. Oh my gosh. Allie, this is insane. Knox, like isn't it beautiful? I thought we just drove up and got here too. We did the hike. Knox, do you think that there's whales in here? No. Oh. <laughs> oh. Do you want daddy to get in? Yeah. Oh, I don't know if I want to get in, Knox. It's so cold. No, go on. Did you touch it? Not it's you. freezing. Knox just said to Cole, you need to go in and look for whales and sharks. And dolphins? And dolphins. And dinosaurs? No, yep. dinosaurs don't live in the water. <laughs> this is what's happening. Enzo's trying to get off of her. <laughs> we don't have a house. A new house? Knox, look, should we race? Look how fast we're going. Ready? Yes. Hold on! Except for some Hold reason, <laughs> if you're not doing it. Hold on! <laughs> look at your paddle. Look Hold at the on. boys. Her paddle's just going straight through the wall. <laughs> I'm going. There it is. Yeah, baby. Now he's going. Okay, we are so happy right now because we drove two hours to get here. Oh and when we gosh, got here, it started pouring rain and it was really cloudy. You couldn't really even see the mountain. Yeah, and then like an hour later, 45 minutes later, it totally cleared up. It's actually really warm now. And I think a lot of people left because of the rain. The lake is not that busy and it is so beautiful. It's even more beautiful than it looks in photos. But you can rent these boats. So we're in these wooden row boats. You can rent them for $20 for 30 minutes or for $35 for an hour. And you don't have to reserve it in you advance. You just go straight yeah, to the dock fun. and then you can rent them and take them out. We had so much fun there. That is definitely a place I would add to your itinerary if you were thinking of going to the Dolomites. That was one of the favorite things we've done on this whole trip. I've heard that in the summer it gets a little bit more crowded. We're here um, late May and so I think it's a little less crowded and we went in the middle of the day and it really wasn't bad. Most people recommend going early in the morning if you want it to be less crowds, but we didn't have a problem with crowds and we didn't make it there until like three. And then Diesel. Cole's <laughs> reading a book from memory while driving. Diesel <laughs> he wanted to like do it. it so he got, he got all the- Oh babe, pull the brake. Hi Enzo. Oh my gosh. Turn, turn. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> turn the other way. Hugs. Go, mommy. Woohoo! <laughs> Oh, I'm 
George Washington. No, I'm George Washington. No, I'm George Washington. No, I'm George Washington. No, I'm George Washington. You're George Washington. <laughs> we had to visit the farm one more time before we take off. They have goats over here. I think the horses are out right now. I don't even know what these are. Sheep? Goats? And all these cows and bunnies. Okay, we are about to go on this hike to Lake, oh, I can't even say it, Lake Karesi. And this is the starting point of the park. What is it? I don't know. I don't even know what it looks like. But this is, this is beautiful. Indo, are you ready? Are you ready? No. Okay, so this is literally one minute There's away from the parking lot. Nice. We're going to do the two mile hike, but if you're on a short time, or if you are like interested in hiking, it's still worth coming here because it is... If you are in the Dolomites, this place is a must do. You can even bring like a stroller on this path. There's like two different ways you can go. We did the loop, which is a little shorter. And you could bring like a jogging stroller. Kids can totally do it. Pets can do it. Older people can do it. And the views the whole time are <laughs> just two boys no, no, no. taking in the view. <laughs> <laughs> oh no! This looks like a, oh, it's a big one. We got a big one. Uh -oh. We ended up having so much fun in the Dolomites. We stayed for nine days and it was seriously such an incredible time. We definitely want to go back here and we just basically took time to relax, chill, explore, and enjoy nature. We didn't vlog a ton, but it was awesome. We're headed to Venice next, so if you want to follow us there, you can subscribe. And if you like this video, give it a thumbs up.